So what we're doing today is a little social experiment of sorts to see if it is possible to fake true amazement. So we put a little ad on Craigslist to gather an audience, which was surprisingly easy. Let's see what ordinary people will do in the quest to be on television or YouTube. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. This is Hi, everybody. Hi. How's it going? Thanks for being here. Have you guys ever seen magic on television before? Yes. Okay. I've seen it there. It's kind of hard to do magic on television because it's really something you got to be there live to really believe that it's happening. And there'll be some things, you know, that are really intended for the viewers at home after a couple Hollywood effects are done to it. But I want you to just really visualize how that would look to them at home. And we're going to make it look like everything you're watching is happening on this beautiful stage. Oh, yeah. And you guys met Derek, he's our director. So I will step off stage. We're in this Victorian theater. It's the vaudeville era. Okay, I'm excited. Every episode of Magic Meltdown has real people authentically reacting naturally to the magic that they see. Every single one of them. Except for this one. We're still looking for astonished reactions, even though now you're aware of what may be going on a little bit. We're gonna use the chroma key technology, so everything that's green will be invisible. Just imagine, if you will, like that, that I was showing my hand empty, and then all of a sudden the handkerchief just kind of came out of nowhere. Because you won't okay. see, you won't see him, you won't see this. It'll all be invisible. You don't see him at all. It's, it's, you get that. You get that. Cool. Back to one. Oh! <laughs> they trust when this is finally cut that it will look like they're reacting to a miracle. That's what we're telling them. Yeah. I'm just thinking more of an ooh, rather than a oh. Yeah. Ooh. Fantastic. I will attempt to perform a feat never before attempted. Would you like to see me levitate this mahogany table? Yeah. Yes. Huh? Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, what, what do I see? <laughs> I cannot believe my eyes. Do oh. y'all see this? Do y'all see this? Where's it going? Wow, it's floating. It's floating. It's actually floating. It's a floating table. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present you a feat of self levitation. Stop, I'm so sorry. We're looking for much more here. Like, here's this man, before there is special effects and technology, who's levitating as astonished as you can uh, be. So this is like pre-Peter Pan. This is something that would have never been seen on stage. That's right. And, and remember, it's a one-man show. And so, right. like, this is... When he levitates, he's floating free of any, any contrivance. I ad-lib that toe movement. Does that work for you? It looks like you're floating. It's very nice. Well, we coach them instantly. No, we're not touching. His feet are not touching his foot. Oh, oh. Uh. <laughs> Float down, Justin. Float down. What? Do that one more time, but it just so you guys can see what this. Not the whole picture, not with the backdrop, is superimposed. But I'd like you to see this table levitation because it really is going to look so amazing. Can we show them what it's going to look like after the editing? Yeah. Just okay. Whoa. Uh, uh, it's gonna look really nice. Yeah. <laughs> no, this is not happening. Oh, this is happening. Oh. Oh. Then suddenly, at the very end, it was scary real. <laughs> when I saw the green screen, I mean, I just thought like we we're going to see fake magic, but it actually was real, and I believe it. I actually had to look down to make sure yeah. there wasn't yeah. a little person in a green <laughs> Like when we did the table at the end, I was like, okay, where'd the green guys go? Why is it still working? He didn't even need the people, so how did he do that? You said you wanted an O, they gave you an O. Whoa. You said stand up and run around. Seriously, are not touching. Does this mean we as magicians are just working too hard? Maybe some of those other TV magicians, they're onto something. <laughs> yeah. Craigslist. The magic is real. 
is real.